I know most conservative practice has been looking at young kids, but what have you seen of Georgia Tech's option offense? It's a lot of a lot of trickery going on. You just got to be disciplined with your eyes and you know play keys and just play hard and be sound. And just play uh, straight technique and don't do nothing special or there. They have a great day, a big day out of you in their running game. At the defensive end position, who do you most often end up hitting? Uh, the tackle or the tight end. But I, I see they don't run a lot of tight end uh, formations, so they're gonna run, it's going to be a lot of tackle, blocking down, or you know, somebody pulling, or even just me reading off the quarterback, see if he's going to hand out the dive, or try to run your box in the pitch, try to keep it running inside. Just got to stay disciplined, really. Is this one of those games where you have to worry about over-pursuing and being too aggressive? Because that's, sometimes that's what they want you to be as a defensive end. Yeah, I see uh, a lot of from film, a lot of defensive ends become over-aggressive, and that's when they, they hand off a dive or the quarterback will fake the pitch and run up inside of the defensive end. And lots of stuff. So I basically just got to play discipline, uh, be smart, don't uh, make any bad decisions when the quarterback keeps the ball, if he does keep the ball a lot in, um, during this game. Because I know they're going to try, you know, they're going to try and make plays off uh, mistakes and try and hopefully hit a home run of this triple option offense. Is it hard to be disciplined because y'all by nature are the aggressive players? Yeah, it's, it's going to be hard to be disciplined because a lot of times everybody always wants to make plays. So when you see somebody with the ball, you automatically want to make a play. So you don't want to take him, then he might end up pitching it when you got to play your keys. So it's, it's going to be kind of hard because we're, we're really aggressive uh, defense up front, especially where our front seven, we're, we're very aggressive. And we want to, you know, try to make plays and be physical with the other team. So we got to just be disciplined and not too concerned, but a little concerned. Do they do more cut blocking than most teams you've seen? Man, yes, I think they cut block uh, every play, about every play. I think they cut block every play. Are you having to watch more film on Georgia Tech than maybe most offenses you've seen because it's so unorthodox from what you're used to? Yeah, we have to watch a lot. We watch a lot of film ever since we uh, we find out we were playing them to see what type of offense are. Uh, besides seeing them playing the ACC championship against Florida State, uh, we've seen that they play, they cut a lot and they they spread out their offensive line to try and create a lot of big gaps for the running backs. And we just know we're gonna have to fit it up and you know stay you know play our football and we know we can that we know we can and just keep on playing hard throughout the game and come out with a win. The Egg Bowl probably wasn't y'all's best defensive effort. Do you have much you're looking forward to get back on the field and redeeming yourselves? Uh, we, we're really looking forward. Everybody came out, you know, put the Egg Bowl past us and just kept on coming out each, each and every day since uh, the Egg Bowl and come practicing hard. Like, we never played the Egg Bowl. Even though we lost in it, everybody still, you know, remembers the game. It's nothing to forget. But we know we just got to put that game past us and, and make the next game, you know, our best game. We haven't talked to you since all ACC teams were announced. Do you feel flattered about the attention? Yeah, I feel uh, very uh, – I'm really happy about being selected on the all ACC team. You know, to show how, how how much hard work the team uh, has put in besides myself. You know, without the team, I wouldn't have got that accolade. You know, this great season we've been having. And uh, all this hard work we've been putting in and finally paying off. And, you know, me getting accolade usually shows just how hard I mean, I, I've been playing and how many plays I've been making along with my teammates. You could have played your home game in your home state. Are you disappointed that you get to go to Florida? Man? No, uh, I, I I really like Miami. I love home, but I like Miami. I like Miami. I've been to Miami one time in spring break, and I really love the, you know, the atmosphere. It's, it's always one of those places you just wish you could stay long. So what do you ask looking? you about that spring break? Uh, no. What happens in Miami stays in Miami. So what are you looking forward to uh, this time heading back down there? You know, uh, besides, you know, practicing and playing in the uh, NFL Stadium, just want to go down there and have fun, you know, enjoy the scenery and, you know, enjoy South Beach or wherever we may land at, uh, wherever the area they have for us to, you know, enjoy, go around, you know, just have fun, enjoy this bowl experience. This is my last one with the team. Have fun with my teammates. Be safe and, you know, go out and hopefully get a win.